Hello, it's Steve here, the Ponytail Pensioner, and today I'm walking between Hereford and ross on wye what turned out to be a 23-miler. Well, I'm en route to Brampton Abbots, a very lovely, I have to say, unwelcome incised valley lies between me and where I need to get to next. When you've done 18 and a half miles, and I'm feeling every, every flipping step at the moment, and there's a stiff breeze, which kind of matches my whole lower body, stiff and sore. 18 and a half miles in, I'm on the Herefordshire Way, which, like a lot of my walking today, has been, this actually isn't too bad at the moment, but it's got potential to get overgrown with stingers. The ponytail pensioner is feeling it at the moment, feeling tired, but also feeling exhilarated. I spent the last 10 minutes figuring out whether you could have a howling breeze, and I decided you couldn't. You can have a howling gale. So I think breezes are quantified in terms of their stiffness, and it's definitely bucked up to a stiff breeze. Ow, stunk and brambles, so it's, it's not just stingers, it's bramble, brambleoids as well. As we said, thank fuck for that. The clear terrain. I love finding trig points with their familiar concrete pillars, usually perched in lofty places. There are around 7,000 of these in mainland Britain. Today I was after a rare beast, an elusive specimen, a fundamental benchmark. There's only about 200 of these, and I reckon I've only ever seen one. And that was at Newlyn when I visited the Tidal Observatory and saw how sea level was measured. What well, a ponytail pensioner is on a bit of a geodetic pilgrimage. And I'm in the village of Brampton Abbots, and I'm looking for a fundamental benchmark, which I'm led to believe is here about somewhere. So yeah, fundamental benchmark, there's about 200 of them. I've, I've heard various estimates of how many there actually are. Uh, 190 are mentioned in the Great Triangulation. And about 200, and some of the specialist online benchmark baggers have just over 200. Um, the only report I could find about this one suggested it was massively overgrown. We'll see. Okay, so I never quite found what I was looking for. Maybe one day I'll come back with a weed whacker and see if I can clear the undergrowth and maybe find that damned elusive fundamental benchmark. St. Michael's and All Angels, Brampton Abbots. Wooden tiles, slaty type tiles as well, and a timber tower. So there you go, that's the, that's the beautiful, coarse textured, 400 million year old old red sandstone. It's a nice half timbering there in the porch. And, uh, and altogether very attractive churchyard in the afternoon sunshine and stiff breeze. Rather magnificent. Well, I never did find that fundamental benchmark walking fans. But never mind, maybe one day I'll go back with that weed whacker. I did, however, enjoy the little church very much indeed, and it was only a few more miles to get back to ross on wye my final destination. All in all, another great day in the Wye Valley. Thank you for watching again, walking fans. Follow me. I'm Steve, the Ponytail Pensioner.